Okay guys, so this is a stone vault. You say it already. <laughs> we felt it was. Um, there's something wrong with the specialization of, of our hewer. As I understood from other and another player. So anyway. Which is more important? Last time I was saying we got this affix uh, which is actually draining seconds from your urn if you die. 15 seconds or something like that for each and every queue. And yeah, we shall. And that's a hardcore dungeon to be timed at, at this point. In such a week and in with such an affix, I'm not sure that if, if that's not a, a default affix already, because it's almost every time there. So I haven't read about it. Maybe it's just um, like the casual one. One of the like you got the fortified or the tyrannical, and you got that one, and you got another two affix which. If the bargain this week, uh, void bound. I got one relatively big problem. I'm not sure if it this will be fixed while I advance with my uh, when I proceed with my questing. But I tried questing actually. I some of the NPCs in the Nerubian territories uh, in their city are not NPCs. responding, and I tried many things, and it's still not happening. And um, I can't actually use that beautiful stone uh, to take an item in exchange from it. And it's a set item and I got one set item here which I'm not using because it's with the wrong stats but of course when I got at least two set items which will happen eventually would happen <laughs> if I could commune to those NPCs but they are not responding so they don't want to speak to me uh, so I thought it's some kind of um, reputation with the weavers and I hope so I still haven't become a uh, renown level of 2 with them. I haven't level my renown with them still, but I'm very close to that. I'm not sure even with that it's happening. Because maybe it's a bug. I have. Ooh! No! I've been searching uh, for players with the same problem. It seems it's happening, but it's rare one of those situations where you got like, I don't know, 1% of the people, maybe less than that, got the same problem. Most probably even less than that. Maybe it could be 1% with all the people that are casual players and don't actually care about that stuff. So it's occurring this problem, but it's not very often, so yeah. I uh, guess I got the short stick this time. Or the cruise How's the term here? Cruise. Anyway, you understood me. So, yeah, uh, after all, uh, I wanna still be. Uh, like taking this item, so I'll, I'll read a little bit more and maybe one, one friend um, uh, gave me the recommendation, proposed that I can actually um, uh, write a letter 
я на Ода на тикет в Blizzard. As long... From what I've heard, this is a slow process. Usually, if they respond at some point, it's, it's not happening instantaneously. But some people have another kind of experience and their problems have been solved uh, in quite a few days, for example. Uh, in some short period of time. So I, I'm not sure, I'm not sure how to proceed. Maybe I'll try a little bit more to, to grind the, the quests. I think maybe my quest, main quest line is also booked because I'm not sure uh, if I have finished it. I can do pretty much all the quests that are available to me. They're not so much because maybe with, with the completion of some quests other, uh, others are actually uh, opening. Are, um, now. <laughs> You're opening the way to, to another quest, so I will finish some. Um, so, yeah. I'll try that first before all else. I'll see if I can fix it. Ooh, I didn't expect to die here. And we'll see what can happen. There if nothing changes for the better. I'll just um Write a ticket and hope for the best. By the way, nowadays, guys, there's a significant, amazing, um, like, I have never seen such a burden on all actions, uh, all soul stocks, so, um, you know, um, crypto also, we have seen the price of the Bitcoin. Uh, skyrocketing and all that stuff it's like something you can make some good bucks from literally you can double <laughs> the amount of money most probably you are investing so it's a good opportunity I've made some money personally and mm, some of my friends uh, did the same, but already, but, but many are, aren't using that opportunity for different reasons. Uh, it's not something you want to miss. Might be one of the few times in the, that's happening once in a lifetime now. That that woman is is like uh, making some of the stocks and crypto skyrocket. Literally, you know, BlackRock invested in um, Bitcoin, so it, it first of all it can be farmed a little bit longer. Um, this in a very similar way, cause it's already harder, so the blockchain will just grow. And yeah, now I am positive at some point it will reach at least 100k. It will be very soon, soon enough, maybe next year. Um, 120 most probably and now I am seeing the opportunity for Bitcoin to reach a million at some point. Not very, it could be like, I don't know, five years, but not very far in the future also. I mean, it's not, now I am seeing it. I mean, many, many people were predicting that can happen and will happen eventually. Now I am seeing that opportunity being more realistic than ever. Um, now, once again, if I had to give an advice, I wouldn't give an advice to, to buy Bitcoin on uh, 80k. It's that the, the price is too high. We have to see what will happen. Uh, but I, I would hold it. 
we sold much of ours actually um, on 68k for example it was a hundred percent profit so it, it was still valuable but now I would um, hold and um, most probably the investment in Bitcoin will be actually small parts so small uh, investments in, in Bitcoin will always be like top investment from here on if you if you can afford it of course and if you still it, it, it's a little bit riskier than uh, most of the stocks for example if you wanna uh, make sure profit like you can invest you just take some money and invest in Tesla for example Tesla in the long run if you are a long run player if you don't care so much about trading um, you know doing that daily routine in that manner uh, maybe just invest some, some money in Tesla for example it, it will skyrocket this year for sure it will most probably reach around I, I am predicting it, it to reach around 700 maybe uh, maybe 800 dollars in, in a year or two um, even Musk and I guess the, the other guys that are uh, responsible for the decisions there gambled um, a lot on some risky projects I would say Fina financially risky projects good that Musk that doesn't care so much about losing some money so yeah but the gamble is won now when uh, actually Trump was elected as a president so we will we will have one one very positive period for the economy worldwide especially in the US of course um, and I would suggest you do something about it in this period because it could be one of the, the last uh, so to speak easy to get rich moments in, in human history for, for quite a while in the future I'm not seeing that happen most probably there, there will be a small crash also during that period but after uh, this is the last mandate of um, Trump so after it's over mm, that won't be anything funny anything funny anything that's fun won't happen after that for quite a while with the centralization most probably will become the economy will suffer out I'll put it that way I just am not seeing anyone that can um, do half of the things he is actually doing nowadays uh, for the economy to grow, to continue growing in a vast manner so yeah take your chances now <laughs> or regret it later it's, it's like that in my opinion of course it's not a financial advice but it, it's a it's a, a, a personal personal like you know it's a, an advice to friends to the friends like it's <laughs> a personal advice I'll strongly suggest you do that now if you if you got some spare money that is plus uh, have in mind the uh, inflation most probably will continue growing at some point after a short recession and there will be a crash so if you don't make some money now if you if you need that if you if you want to if you don't make some good good profits now may, maybe later it will be a little bit harder than it was before like nothing is stable now everything is volatile so you have to adapt to that kind of situation and take the most from it before the gates close cause this period is coming now we are seeing it as clear as it could be. 
And the doors are slowly closing for us. You got smart ideas, wanna make, create a business, uh, wanna grow your business, now is also the moment. Don't miss that opportunity because it, in, in 10 years from now it will be most probably almost impossible to start something that will actually grow quite significantly, potentially even. You won't have that opportunity. It, it will be very, very much harder than it is nowadays. It's still easy. Maybe now it will be one of the easiest periods, but you gotta be fast already. It's it's not super easy. The competition is in nearly every niche is enormous, Gig gigantic. And still, you got you still got chances. Everyone has chances now still. The right idea, a little bit more precision and a little bit more focus on it and it can it can just work. Just work out. Especially if you are a US citizen, it won't be super hard now. You have some oh I gotta focus on this boss. Sorry guys, I won't be speaking for a while. But now is the right moment to make moves. If you miss that moment, after that, like I already said, it won't be easy and fun. Even here, I thought it was like here was the right place. So you gotta. Eh. I understood the, 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 the exact mechanics now. But yeah, it's relatively hard because you gotta uh, stay on this field here, but when there's a mech, when it, it's exploding uh, here, now you, you shall move away from that, or is it, yeah, you shall move away from it, and then you shall not be, yeah, it's, it's like sophisticated. We're gonna move around this spot and this spot here. I think they, they'll, they'll be able to finish eventually. Yep. Mm. Shall we release it, I think? It's maybe even faster. means 30 seconds loss from that, it's not so bad, not so good either. This is a hard dungeon. Maybe one of the hardest. It, it was kind of uh, slow and not very, not much fun to together my party. Also, it it, it cost some time. 
to be honest, I don't know, like half an hour maybe. A little bit less than that, but it wasn't super like uh, super fast like the other dungeons. I think I got one death after all. I don't know why. You're telling me that. Maybe I could pull them, but not more than two, I think. I got like 10, which is exactly the average. But I remember one if I have to be honest. Ah, yeah, maybe. Not sure. Maybe, maybe that person. Exactly two. <laughs> Maybe. Now I wonder, is that dungeon actually harder on um On fortified or on tyrannical? It's a very nice question, I totally don't know the right answer to that. Oh wow, that's that's the hundred percent of the the last percent of the fall of the mobs. Oh, the enemies. There's only one last boss. Here, but I haven't played so much this dungeon if I have to be honest. Like, I've got two or three car keys. I 
Момент. А, we have to do something with those portals, I think. Someone has to run and close them. We can read it here. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Aha! So the void corruption can only be removed by moving close to an activate void void drift. I understand now. I was kind of uh, wrong about it, but that's why I didn't actually help me kind of. It was a relatively clear run after all. I mean, in mind I'm a little bit fun in this dungeon. And not only, <laughs> but oh, let's see. We have something now. also this will be the only dinner for today most probably and I will see you soon enough later anyway.